On 9.30 a.m., uh, officers were called to 715 Fifth Avenue. Uh, actually, they, they came upon 17, 15, 715 Fifth Avenue. Originally, they were called to that area for uh, reported gunshots fired. Uh, officers arrive on scene. They quickly find uh, a man, Mark Susi, 57 years old, in the alleyway behind 715 Fifth Avenue. Uh, and inside of the, the residence at 715 is a 54-year-old uh, woman, Lisa Susi. Uh, they're a husband and wife. Uh, they've been estranged for the last um, six weeks or so, I'm told. And uh, it appears as though he he's, he shot her, and, and she is deceased, unfortunately, tragically. And he is at uh, Albany Medical Center Hospital undergoing surgery at this time for a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Is he expected to survive? He is expected to survive. Uh, we do expect to charge him. Uh, he hasn't been charged yet, but we, we expect to charge him. Um, and. That's where we're at right now. Uh, the family has all been notified. There's there's two families involved um, because they both had had uh, children from from other marriages as well. Um, and it's just uh, you know it's a horrific time. It's a horrific scene, uh, and you know and the guys are dealing with it. So the road's going to be closed for a while longer. Did they have children together? Um, that I'm not aware. Of. And how do you spell that name, Susie? It is. Uh, S O U S I E. Word S O U S I E. Was the woman shot inside the home or outside? Inside the home. There, there was a family member that was inside the home at the time on the second floor. Um, I believe on the second floor, somewhere else in the home. And he was alerted to a, an argument that was going on, and then he heard one gunshot wound, and, and then other gunshot, no, not gunshot wound, uh, one gunshot. Then he heard uh, uh, some other gunshots, and then. Uh, and then a final gunshot that was out in the alley outside of the, the house. I know you said they were estranged, but were they both living there together? They weren't living there together for the, for the last few weeks, no. Who was living there? Uh, Lisa Susie was living there. I don't know who else, but she was living there. Is there an uh, order of protection in effect at this time? Uh, not that I'm aware of at this time. No, nothing that came up you know, when we ran the names. You've been called to that address or had any interactions with these two individuals before uh, we today? Did, we, we did recently have a, a domestic a domestic incident report was filed Involving between the two of them. Two of them. Yeah. What but weapon? Prior was to that, used? there wasn't anything. What kind of gun was used? Uh, a shotgun. Was that recovered back in the alley? I saw an officer it handling was. that. Yeah. Did he shoot? Was his shot to the head? I'm not going to get into that. Um, was the vehicle... it was fatal? The, the, the shot was fatal. But, so. I mean, his shot to himself. Oh, to himself, yes. Yeah. He shot himself in the head with a shotgun? He shot himself, at, uh, yeah, I mean, that's where he was aiming. Um, he, he, he didn't die, though, as a result of that. Would it be accurate so. to say the bullet? We had very little traffic the whole morning, and then apparently it's Grants at the station. But they had a, uh, would it be accurate to say that the bullet grazed him, or was it a more Oh, situation? no, he, he has some, some very serious injuries to his face. Um, but I... I'm not going to get into all that. That's all, you know, that's medical stuff. So. What is he going to be charged with? Uh, it, well, I would say he's going to be charged with murder. Uh, but, but that, 